So normal bit set wise questions is they can ask you simple 45 second bit is like this. A light ray is incident on the prism and it comes out through the prism prism with minimum deviation minimum deviation 30 degrees then refractive index of the prism index of the prism sir most of the people they fear about physics first how to approach the problem if i am 11th class student or 12th class student how to approach the problem first i should understand the meaning of the question what they given light ray is incident on the prism first i have to know the diagram of prism abc is a prism is incident on the prism like this he he said any angle to you no just let it be imagine this is normal n1 n2 in ray optics first of all if you should approach the things with normals why because angle of incidence or anything i want to measure means with normal only light is incident on the surface like this and incident on the prism and comes out through the prism with the minimum deviation very very important thing underline this point minimum deviation means light is refracted parallel to the base of the prism that's the very important point refracted parallel to the base of the prism and comes out like this extend this light and extend this light this is a deviation 30 so well and good i think so now it is easy to understand the thing minimum deviation capital d now we can apply the condition for refractive index mu equal to sin of a plus d by 2 by sin a by 2 sin a he doesn't say anything about prism if they don't mention anything in the prism you should approach with an equilateral triangle equilateral triangle 60 degrees minimum deviation 30 by 2 upon sin 60 by 2 that is sin 90 by 2 sin 45 by sin 30 sin 45 1 by root 2 sin 30 1 by 2 all of you know i think so that is 2 by root 2 is i am going to get what sir root 2 is the refractive index of the prism this is the way of approaching the problem with the diagrammatic approach.